Hey guys, it's Martin. Today I'm going to talk to you about the best home remedies for hemorrhoids. If you've got hemorrhoids, you know how bad they can be, you know how much they stink, the pain, the burning, the irritation. Well today I am going to discuss the things you can do inside your home to help you get rid of those hemorrhoids, get rid of that hemorrhoid pain, and feel much better. I've been where you are. I know what it's like having hemorrhoids. It's the worst thing in the world, so I'm going to help you out today help you figure out what you need to do to get that relief you need. So let's jump right in. This is a sitz bath that you can find on Amazon. Now what a sitz bath does is it basically allows you to soak the hemorrhoid and get some relief. And a sitz bath is a really, really good way to soak your hemorrhoid and get some relief. You can always, if you don't have a sitz bath and you're watching this right now and you really want to get relief, Fill your bathtub up with some lukewarm water and use that. It's very soothing. I've done it before. I will warn you, getting in is the worst part. It can sting really bad right when you get in. But after you get in, it's nice, it's relaxing, and it you will not feel any pain while you're actually in the water. So if you can, get a sitz bath. If not, if you're watching this at home, just jump in the bathtub. Um, one other great product to use is this hemorrhoid soak. You can find this on Amazon at $15.95. It's from Better Bath, Better Body. Really good hemorrhoid soak, juniper and the oily oils, um, some other good ingredients, vitamin C, geranium, etc. So this is something that you can use. You don't need it, but it's something you could definitely use as well. A good uh, hemorrhoid home remedy. Moving on, Metamucil fiber, you don't have to get Metamucil, but if you're constipated, you're going to make your hemorrhoids much worse. A lot of times hemorrhoids are actually caused from constipation. So if you're chronically constipated and you have chronic hemorrhoids, those are linked together. One good thing to do would be either to get a Metamucil fiber supplement or just get more fiber in your diet on a daily basis. Eat more foods with with, that are high in fiber and that will make a difference. The last thing you want to do if you have hemorrhoids is be constipated and if you find you're frequently constipated and you frequently have hemorrhoids, well those two are linked. Get more fiber in your diet, don't eat as many processed foods, you know, eat vegetables and fruits and, and work on that aspect of it and it will make your hemorrhoids much better. Moving on, we have the squatty potty. Your bathroom habits will play a big role. You don't need to get the squatty potty, but basically what the squatty potty does is you put your feet up here, and when you're sitting on the toilet, it prevents you from putting too much pressure on your anal veins and prevents you from getting hemorrhoids as much or causing uh, your hemorrhoids to get worse. So one thing you must do, regardless of whether you get the squatty potty or not, is Wait till you actually have to go to the bathroom to sit on the toilet. You don't want to be sitting on the toilet for 10 minutes at a time. All that's going to do is increase the blood flow to your hemorrhoid veins and make your hemorrhoids even worse. Another thing, don't squeeze very hard. If you've got hemorrhoids and you're frequently constipated and you're squeezing super hard uh, to, to pass a bowel movement, it's just going to make it much worse. It's going to make your hemorrhoids much worse. It might even give you frequent hemorrhoids if you do this a lot. Um, as I said earlier in terms of the, the fiber right here, which can help with constipation, drink lots of water too. Water will help you if you have constipation and, and you're sitting on the toilet for a long period of time because of it or you can't go and you're squeezing really hard because of it. Don't do that. Check out the Squatty Potty. Check out Metamucil. Drink more water and try and go to the bathroom when you're ready to go. Uh, moving on, another home remedy obviously is Preparation H. You've got the ointments, you've got the wipes. Uh, in my opinion, this is definitely the best hemorrhoid ointment that Preparation H offers. It's their maximum strength pain relief cream. Use, use an ointment, use a wipe, they're gonna help. They will help a lot, especially if you're doing everything else I'm talking about. You absolutely, when you are using the bathroom, you will want to use a hemorrhoid wipe to wipe when you're done. Why? You don't want to use toilet paper. Toilet paper will make things worse. The other thing that a hemorrhoid wipe has 
is it has witch hazel, which is an astringent, which is great for hemorrhoids. So that's why I would recommend using a hemorrhoid wipe. You're also going to want to use a hemorrhoid cream. These are both great products. And then finally, check out this hemorrhoid supplement on Amazon. It's called Hemorrhoid Plus. Um, as I had said with the witch hazel, this has witch hazel as well, just like the, the creams and the wipes do. But it also has a lot of other herbs. It's a great at-home remedy you can use for your hemorrhoids. You know, it's got butcher's broom, vitamin C, hesperidin, bilberry extract, horse chestnut. These are all great ingredients. It's called Hemorrhoid Plus. Wonderful at-home hemorrhoid remedy you can use in the privacy of your own home. So back from the beginning, you know, if you can get a sitz bath, great. You don't need to. This bath soak is awesome. Otherwise, if you don't have either one of those or you don't want to order them, no big deal. Just jump in a bathtub and get the relief you're looking for. If you're constipated, you're going to want to use uh, Metamucil or something similar or just stop eating processed foods and eat healthier. If you can't do that, I know it's very difficult for people. Drink more water. Water will definitely help you not be constipated. And constipation is a big cause of hemorrhoids. Use a hemorrhoid ointment or cream. It's going to help with the pain. It'll help reduce the swelling. Use a, a hemorrhoid supplement like Hemorrhoid Plus. It's got the witch hazel just like the creams, and the, ointment, uh, the creams, the ointments, and the wipes do. If you have really bad hemorrhoids and they've been chronic, you might want to try something like the Squatty Potty. That could definitely help. Um, really good product to uh, you know, stop hemorrhoids and, and prevent them from happening. Um, it's also got a really funny commercial, that video, check it out. And then the Preparation H wipes, these are really good as well. They have the Witch Hazel Astringent, as you can see. And so those are five or six at-home remedies you can use today to start getting relief from your hemorrhoids, getting rid of your hemorrhoids, and feeling better. If you have any other at-home remedies that you've used that work really well, comment below. If you have any questions about any of these at-home remedies, also comment below. I love helping out. I appreciate you guys watching my channel. And if you have any questions, I'm here. Let me know.